Hello everybody, this is Akutami and we're back today with The Sims 2 Pleasant View. This is round number 9, part number 10, the Langrat family. And uh, Robbie is at work, trying to earn that promotion, which he should get. Kaylin has work later. Yes, Kaylin goes to work in a couple of hours. She needs a bit of a shower. Why don't you just take a shower? And of course, we have our baby boy Nemo. Why did I name him Nemo? No, it doesn't matter. And we have little Nemo, our baby boy. And um, I don't think we've tried for baby again yet, but we need to do that because we need to have at minimum two kids. Probably three would be better, but at minimum two kids. What do you need for work? No, you're good. You're good. Let me guess. She's gonna... Kaylin, seriously? Is this all you're gonna do? You don't want to better yourself? We could, um... Is your car coming an hour? Is there anything you need to do cleaning-wise? You need to call some friends before... Is it early? Is it late enough to call friends? Maybe you can call some friends before work. Have we hired a nanny? I assume we have, but she just had the baby in the last part, so I don't actually know. Let's... Yes, we have because the nanny is here. Alright, good. See, I'm on top of things. Even when I don't know that I'm on. <laughs> Even when I don't know what I'm doing, I'm still on top of things. Oh, thank you for cleaning. Alright, sweetie, you're going to have to go to work. Well, not right this second. You can get Mary Sue up. No, go on to work. Go earn that promotion. Hmm. You're a high school teacher. Go teach them students. See it all it, it jumps automatically up to her job performance just as soon as she gets to work. I don't I don't remember it ever being this easy to get promotions. I don't think I have a mod in that makes it e I wouldn't have put a mod in to make it easier. I would have put a mod in to make it harder, but not to make it easier. Hmm. I don't know. It's very strange. So the gardener is here. I guess we should put it on free speed since nobody else is here. The gardener is here. He's taking care of all the things. Robbie's home. Yes. Oh, he brought a friend home with him. Funny. Robbie has been promoted to protector of the whales. Moving up in the world tends to mean being less hands-on and more uh, managerial. The protector of the whales, you now spend most of your time behind a desk and on the phone lobbying to bureaucrats in SimCity to pass more stringent whale rights legislations. It's not e exactly working for the man, but it's working in a really close proximity to him. Okay. What do you need to do? You need to get your mechanical up. Do you know Mary Sue well? Sort of. Uh, girls, socialize. Let's get her our socialization up with Mary Sue. She can be... There'll be one less friend you've got to get. Oh, he just told her about what her husband did. Oh... We'll pay the bills. Don't you worry. Don't you worry, Sheldon. Mm. 
<laughs> oh, she really does need some work. <laughs> Textures on that sweater is real pretty. It does. It's very, it's very nice textured. The way it falls. Very nice. Very nice. Now you can pay the bills. Then you're probably going to need to energize. Uh oh. Spirit Day for the high school is approaching and everyone is expected to participate, even teachers. However, things aren't so simple for Kaylin, who is up for evaluation before the school board on the same day. It's one thing to be spirited on a normal day with face paint and a crazy outfit, and another thing entirely to paint be, when paint and crazy outfit may cost a teacher dearly for not taking evaluation seriously. Kaylin doesn't want to be criticized for lack of school spirit, but she would also like to keep progressing as an educator. What should she do? I want to say dress for spirit day. Yay! Kaylin has never missed a spirit day and she won't start now. Wearing her favorite war paint the ultimate spirit uniform, a disco clown costume, Kaylin treads the halls with spirit fingers flying in, b in the best mood. Already a popular teacher, Kaylin's commitment to spirit and self-expressionism is a big hit with her co-workers, who openly discuss making Spirit Day mandatory for facility and staff. With much bra bravado, Kaylin sashays into a room full of waiting board members who are delighted to see that someone who approaches her job with so much spirit it doesn't take long before the unanimous decision is passed down to send Kaylin off to the local university as a guest lecturer. Kaylin has been promoted. Way to go, Kaylin. I'm glad I got that right. I'm telling you, these cards. Kaylin has been promoted to guest, uh, university guest lecturer. She can now condense a lifetime of study into an hour long lecture. But that won't mean anything if they fall asleep. You'll need to be witty and charismatic to succeed. Okay, so you need to... Oh, you've got everything you need. Okay, are you friendly with her? You don't really know Jennifer. Well, let's take this opportunity to befriend Jennifer. And get the nanny to stop messing with her. And you need to get your mechanical up. So you go do that. And we'll see if Kaylin can befriend Jennifer. That would be good because they don't know each other. But she does know her husband. She needs to... Oh, there's Dawn. Hey, Dawn. She needs to call her friends, too, because Dawn is down to an 80. That's not good. And that girl's down to a 74, and I think we've lost this dude. It's hard maintaining all these friends. Even with the phone hack, it's hard maintaining all these friends. Leave them to it. Yep, you've been promoted again. He's got to be getting close. Garden's looking pretty nice. Yep, we got a mechanical point. Finish for the day. Thank you. 
I'm just gonna let him go ahead and finish out mechanical. Cause he is, uh, eventually I'd like for him to know all the skills. He's doing a pretty good job. We just need creativity, which, yeah, and cooking. And since we've got this bookcase, we should be able to do it, like, no problems. Her making friends with Jennifer is cutting into my time. But I would like them to be friends, but I've got other things I need to be working on. Like getting her pregnant again, which took how many tries last time? Last time we had them with who I don't know how many times, four? Okay, do you need to call any of your friends? Yes, you do, actually. Why did you not put that on the... You know what? Not going to question it. Everybody's calling John. Hey, John, your wife's here. <laughs> yeah, I might have uh, blown... I, I might have let the cat out of the bag and told her about you and Mortimer fighting over someone else. Yeah, um, she might know. She might know. So just heads up there, dude. When your wife gets home, just heads up. Okay, friend. Oh, that was the last friend you needed. Excellent. Kaylin's doing good on friends then. Uh-oh, baby. Uh oh, baby. Because we're making friends. I can't stop making friends. We gotta at least get her up, you know, relatively high so that she won't just drop right back down. Change Nemo's diaper. Uh, cuddle Nemo. Trebinda, a brova da dia sete, trebinda, pe canado. Hey, baba bundi, baba. Oof, chula morna. She's actually in the positive block time now. That's good. She's almost got her. Baby will be okay. It's just a dirty diaper. It's not like he hadn't been fed, because he's got the snapdragon to feed him. So I ain't got to worry about feeding that little critter. Okay, she's close enough. Tell her one more thing and let's go take care of your baby. There you go. Nima's birthday is only a day away. Which means it's time for us to get pregnant again. You need to come relax. What's that, kid? Group. I can't see an answer. Let me just warn you that. Hi, I'm Margaret. Since my friend Curtis had such a good time with you the other day, I thought we'd see if you wanted to go downtown. No. Thank you, but I'm a little bit busy right now. The thing is, I'm really got plans for right now. Uh, no. Uh, make out for a baby. Hoopla, not. 
Uh, Jennifer? <laughs> I was gonna say, Jennifer, you think maybe, uh... Okay, you're not that tired. But, okay, sure. She is, but you're not. I'm sure she I'm gonna have you two try again. Just in case it didn't work the first time. This time we're gonna have him try. Holy nobody's being on Gabia. Is it if the first one didn't work, maybe the second one will work. But oh, I swear we tried like four times the first time to get her pregnant. <laughs> All right, dude. Time for you to come and stargaze. Dude, you don't sleep in a bed. Sleeping is for us. Wimps. You're you're a manly knowledge sim. Knowledge sims have other things that they do. Like search for stars and aliens and things. And Kaylin is already like completely filled up and energized. Um, I could get her up, but I could just let her sleep. She does need to get some logic, ironically enough. But she doesn't really need to. Oh, I haven't checked to see if y'all needed anything. You don't. You don't. And the baby. And there's nothing I can get for him. There's nothing I can get for her. I'd have to get them, send them on a date or something. Okay. Oh, you became best friends with one of those people. Okay. You want to buy a robot station and a train set. And or a train. We could buy a robot station. I'm going to lock down the robot station. I don't know about the train. We could buy a train set. Those things light, start on fire. The train sets, they catch fire. That's the problem with having a train set. But we could stick a train set like out here. But we could also put a robot station out here. She has the, the, this one, the hobby. Yo, know, I'm gonna get you up. And I'm just gonna let you work on the car. I need you to get one of these up. I don't know which one that you're close to getting up. You still need to talk to people, but oh well. It is as it is. Can you look for UFOs? Oh no, I hit the top of the thing! I hate it. I hate it. You can't see it on your recording, but on my recording, the bottom is cut off. Because I hit the stupid bar at the top. Stupid window. <gasps> oh my goodness! Oh, this could be an awkward. We just tried for baby twice. <laughs> Bye, Robbie. <sighs> Kaylin, come work on this car. We're oh, is the engine done? I can't believe we got him inducted. <laughs> There's gonna be so many alien babies around the neighborhood. And we just tried for baby with her. They might wind up having babies at the same time, like within hours of each other. That could be awkward. 
especially since this house is not the biggest thing I've ever seen. I mean, we got room to expand, and we have a little bit of money. So, we need to work on the garden. <sighs> she wants to go on a mountain vacation. Robbie's work is in an hour. Um, yeah, dude, I don't know if he's going to be able to get to work on time. Um, yeah, that's my bad. Yeah, that's my bad. Oh, Robbie gets a sports car now. <laughs> um. Just go ahead and buy the robot station. I might just do that. We got a little bit of money. Buy the robot station. We'll put it right there. We'll have you... Can you not walk to work? I know you missed your car, but you can't walk to work. Oh, 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 walk to work. I just didn't see it. I'm just blind. Have fun at work today, Robbie. Oh, we need to end this episode, too. So, thank you so very much for watching. Do you go to work at 8? What time do you go to work? Oh, I can't see. Oh, you go to work at 11. Okay, so we got a little bit of time. So, thank you so very much for watching. I hope that you enjoy, and I hope that I'll see you back here again real soon. Bye for now, guys.